cushion! Give me a break! You're only level 40! Oh my god! Nothing better be over there attacking my guy. Good afternoon, and thanks for joining me for some more ARC procedurally generated stuff and things. Oh, yeah, baby. Poop. Come on, poop, man. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me today, guys, for some more ARC PG stuff and things. Make sure if you like the video you see today, please don't forget to show your support and smash the thumbs up button. And if you're new and you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. So, we really did well as far as, uh, what are you? You want to go? Level 40 demo for a really cool color. Oh, you're super cool looking. So we did a, a kind of a, an amazing amount of support on the new series. And uh, I wanted to say thank you guys so very, very much for showing your support. Smashing that thumbs up button. Being unbelievable and amazing. I really appreciate it. Oh, it's a 68 list. We, can't, we don't want that guy. So, yeah. Thank you guys so, so very much. Um, we're back to do some stuff and things. First thing, Peggy. We're going to get Peggy some levels. I think we're going to go ahead and just pump some HPs to start off with. Um, we do have some uh, spoiled meat now. I moved inside of here. We have a little bit more right there. So we're going to be good to make some narcotics and kind of continue down the tech tree, so to speak. This is our meat spoiling locker. We've got some hot food action. I got some hot level action. 300 weight, baby. That's what I'm talking about. And a huge amount of engram points. So to start off with today, we've got to get... A dino. And I'm thinking... Le level 16? Really? Level 16? I want to get something good. But the first thing is, it looks like, too, that... Stuff and things are a little bit safer than they were. There's a raptor over there. There's this guy right here doing brain worms. You've definitely got the brain worms! Look at him! Oh, he's got brain worms. You can see it in his eyes. Hello, little fish. Do you have brain? Oh, maybe this whole area is contaminated. I don't know if we should really head over here. So, um, yeah, and I've been hanging out and doing a little bit of stuff and things in the area. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I thought we were safe. It's definitely not safe. Look at that over there, man. The biggest thing we're having a problem with, I've gathered up a few resources, but the biggest thing that I'm having a problem with is fiber and berries. There just aren't a lot. I don't understand why the procedurally generated world with the default settings is like this. Are you stuck, homeboy? What level are you at? Oh, eight. Perfect. Also, um, in the last episode, I was talking a little bit about the difficulty. I do have the difficulty set for, I do believe, as high as it can go. So, and I may not, I don't really know that much about this. To be honest with you, I don't do a lot of the, like, work on the servers. Oh, I'm in a bad place. Oh, Giga, you're kidding me. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, this is terrible. It's so dangerous here. I haven't really ventured over into this area. And I just wanted to walk over here and look. Look at that. Is there... Oh my god, where are we? Maybe we need to go south. Maybe this temporary base is in a bad spot. I don't know if they still, like, observe the north-south... The, 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 you know, the northern and southernness of maps and how normally um, the north... Look at there. There's brain worms. Oh, and that raptor's coming over. Okay. Okay, this is bad. Where's he going? Oh no, they're attacking my trike! I was gonna tame this one trike! There's nothing I can do about it now. Oh, and they're mate boosted, too. This could be bad. And it's going to turn dark. Holy crap, so much is happening at the same time. Okay. Oh, do you see that? Oh, there's two of them. Run with all your red power. Stop getting to run. 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 Running. Legs broken. Dead. <laughs> and we're back under cover of darkness. After all sorts of weird stuff and things have happened. So, as I tried to respawn, the game crashed on me, and... I don't know what that was, but it sounds poisonous. So, uh, yeah, the game crashed on me, and uh, then it rolled back. So, I didn't die. <laughs> uh, so, we're back. Uh, Peggy, Peggy's got his level. I went ahead and crafted one of the S-plus refining forges, and now we have some hot metal action, so we can get into getting a smithy going. Let's go ahead and get this guy. I don't want to lose Peggy. I don't want to... I want, I want Peggy to be our friend. I think we're going to keep Peggy right over here. Just for now, because it's like a super dangerous place outside. Um, also, I think after the crash, something weird happened with dinos. Um, I'm not really sure, because I don't think the same dinos are in the same area, so I have no idea. 
Oh, the cover of darkness. There's our refining forge. I placed it a little bit outside just as kind of a marker in case anybody else was walking around. They could see our base. Plus, it looks BA inside of here like that. That's super cool. So let me see here. Uh, we have a little bit more metal. Man, can we start getting into some metal tools? That would be really preferable, especially. Let me see here. Uh, metal pick, metal hatchet. That's it. We can't get. Um, wait, wait, wait. A pike would be really nice. Hot pike action. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh, yeah. So let's go ahead and squirt that inside of here. What are we going to need to craft a pike up? Let me see. Ten metal. What the frig? Holy crap. All right. Let's just get. Let's just get metal pick and stuff like that. So we need some wood and some hide. Go ahead and squirt that in there. And we'll squirt that in there. Bam. The LEDs can't be stopped. And we need even more metal. So. All right. Well, at least now we can take this guy. Squirt it inside of here like a so. Let us go ahead and put all of our resources back inside of here. I really want to try to get a tame done today. Um, I was hoping to probably just even tame up. You know what? I'm going to put these guys in here. I was hoping just to maybe even tame up um, the trike that was out there. But like I said, there was something that went on with the server. And I think that the dinos were here are gone. Because um, there was a trike here for sure. And there were all sorts of other stuff and things. There were dodos and there was stuff and things everywhere. So, and there's nothing here. So I'm not sure exactly sure. The procedurally generated, keep in mind, guys, you might see that there's like weird bugs, weird stuff and things happening. I don't really know. Um, I've had the game only, the game hasn't been crashy or anything like that, except for the one crash. So I'm not really sure, but it is what it is. All right, so we got our metal pick now, like so. We had, let me see here. Can we get some hot metal action out of you? There we go. One, okay. One is better than nothing. I would have liked more than, okay, two. More than two would be fine. There was a rock that was right here that was super... Peace out, weirdest rock explosion of all time. There was a rock that was right there that was super good for metal. Let me see if there just happens to be anything weird. Like weird rocks on the on the edges here. It looks like there's some... There's some piranha. There's some oil right down there, which isn't that far. It's kind of far if we don't have like flippers and stuff like that. Okay, okay, that's crazy. That's a little bit crazy. So we're going to get two more. Actually, we'll have enough to make an axe, too. I think. Yeah, we should. We should have enough to make an axe as well. There was one rock that was, like, right here that was super good. Um, I want to get enough metal to get a pike, too. And then the main, like, next stage of this is, is just as you would expect. We're going to try to down probably a trike or something that can gather. Well, it doesn't really make any sense. There's definitely, like, a berry shortage. But we're not in a good area for that. I don't know if procedurally generated, and I really hope it's not this way everywhere, but there doesn't seem to be like berries and fiber. And if that's the case, this is like a major problem, like a major huge problem. Um, and I didn't, I thought I heard something. I didn't change anything in the generation. Um, I changed some of the server stats, uh, like difficulty and, and XP rates and stuff like that. But if this is all of the berries, and because really narco berries is, is what we need, um, it's going to be a major disaster. Um, yeah. I'm just looking at it right now and thinking about it. Like, we need to be able to gather a bunch. And so normally when you play Ark, your next stage would be to tame some sort of dino that could help you gather berries. But if, there, if it's this sparse, then really, I don't think that's going to be too helpful. Um, I have three bola on me. Uh, getting a um, a pteranodon might not be a bad idea, so we could start getting some hot flight action. Um, but right now, I think I'm just going to gather up some berries and see how much narco I can make. Maybe look around for a little bit more metal. See if I can get a pike too. I'd like to get around 50 narco arrows. I think that would be a preferable amount, um, but I'm not really sure. With the, the ground being all weird like this and this the lack of berries, I don't think it's going to work out. So we shall see. All right. Whoa. Holy big salmon, baby. You look delicious. You look so delicious. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to gather up some hot metal action. I'm going to make some hot narcotic. And then we can make some arrows. Up there's a stego. There's some brontos up there, too. I don't know what the next stage is. Maybe a little bit more exploring. And we're back. Um, I thought I sped nights up, but it has been night for a long, long time. Oh, there's a Tranodon right there. What level are you, homie? 104! Oh, baby! Oh, no, no, no! Oh, okay. Um, so I just was making up the stuff and things that we needed in order to get our axe and our pike. 
Um, which I think we have. So, let me see here. Let's just grab this. Let's grab this. Let's go in here. Weapons. Melee. Uh, axe. Pike. Okay. So, flint. Wood. Flint. Uh, arrows. What do we need? I can't even remember. Thatch fiber. Okay. Uh, uh, uh Okay. So, arrows. Haha. <laughs> 50. Nailed the days to keep it stopped. I have been making narcotics, but I only have 10. So, will this be enough? I'm um, not sure exactly. Uh, all we can do is try. 20 arrows. 20 should be fine, right? For a pteranodon? Let me see here. Uh, Putaura. Level 35 before I can make the saddle. I'm only 28. Well, okay then. <laughs> Wait, I'm 29. <laughs> so I'm pumping a little bit of hot movement speed action right now. As we craft more stuff and things, we should level up pretty quick. Getting the 35 shouldn't be a real problem. All right, so now inside of here, we've got our axe and our pike. Let's go ahead and put our backup stuff and things inside of here, just in case. Like so and like so. We've got 20 narco arrows right there, like that. Okay, uh, how are we doing here? A little bit of food, a little bit of water. Fill up the skin. Uh, five. Is this the guy? Oh, 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 no! Oh, yes! Are you him? No, this is only a 12! Whatever. Go down. One, two. It's down, it's down, it's down! Okay, so we got one. We got this little guy. Um, I need to make some more bolas, just in case. I thought that was the guy, so it was just kind of a knee-jerk reaction. Um, I don't have any prime meat. We're just gonna tame him up with regular meat. Um, and I know he's super low level, but... We're just starting off, so it's better than nothing. We might as well have him. We can have him as a throwaway dino. Maybe we'll sacrifice him also. His coloring is absolutely unbelievable. Um, so that is good. This is really good. Uh, his torpor level is dropping super duper fast. Um, okay. I think that's the super tranodon right there. Uh, let's go like so. Oh my god. We need so many more berries, man. I just can't get berries fast enough. There he is. He's right there. If he lands, we've got to go for him. We've got to go for it. I know we got plenty of arrows. Is there anything super bad in the area? There's just Parasaurs, Brontos, and all that stuff. Oh, this is it right here. This is it. This is our moment. This is our friggin' moment. Oh, no, it's not our moment. Okay, it's not our moment. Is it going to be our moment? Oh, this is our moment, maybe. This may be our moment right now. This is our moment. We got it. Zerp. One, two, three. Oh, he's being boosted. One. Get out of here. One, two, three, four. I'm just going to pound him a little bit. He's down, he's down, he's down. All right, this is a super good one. Okay, so this is important. We've got a little dumb one that no one cares about. Did I, did I put all the meat on him? I put all the meat. I have some berries. Um, we definitely need to like just start gathering berries up like a fool, like a boss. Um, let me see here. How are you doing for taming? Oh, my God. There's no way. Like, uh, we'll go like that. Is it just because his narco is super low? Yeah, that might be why. Um, all right, so I'm going to gather up huge amounts of berries. I'm not going to have time really to make narco. I got to get this guy tamed up. Um, I don't think I see any way to get prime meat. So that's not going to be a thing. Uh, yeah, we're just going to meat tame this guy and call it good. He's going to be super high level, though, so it's going to be perfect. And we're back. Oh, die, die, die. Oh, my God. We just successfully defended ourselves versus this guy right here. Oh, my God, man. That's crazy. So, oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. So, there's uh, scorpions over here. There are all sorts of stuff and things going on. I went ahead and gathered up a bunch of narco berries. This guy is still taming up. Hasn't even, like, done a tame yet. I thought I had the taming multipliers turned up. Oh, I'm stuck on him. No, 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 no. Come on, game. Uh, stupid game. Stupid! So, I'm stuck on him. Um, let me see here. Is there anything I can do? Is it amazing? Oh, don't hit him. Did you hit him? I don't even know, because he hasn't even tamed up yet. So, I gotta try to figure out how to get off of this guy, but we've definitely gotta be careful in this area. It is not no bueno. What is that over there? Is that an ichthy? There's just bad hombres everywhere is what I'm trying to say. 
And we're back. There's another saber tooth right here. No, you don't! You better not! No! 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 Oh my god, what a stupid jerk! Taming effectiveness down to 37.5%. Um, yeah. And, I mean, what was I even supposed to do? Why would you completely change from what you were attacking to ruining my tame? Thanks so very much, dumbest saber tooth of all time! I'm gonna name you stupid! Stupid jerk. That's your name. And now there's a Giga. There's a Giga! Over here by my tame. What the crap am I supposed to do? This is crazy, guys! There are T-Rexes, RGs, Sabertooth, Scorpions, Gigas. I mean... Bronto, go fight the Giga! Right? Go over there! And our guy lost all of his taming effect- No, don't fall in. He lost all his taming effectiveness. Hopefully that Giga just sticks over there. Because if it comes over into this early type area, it's over for us. Oh, baby. This could be bad. And now there's a scorpion. Die, scorpion! No! Pin cushion! Give me a break! You're only level 40! Oh my god! Nothing better be over there attacking my guy. Oh my god, I accidentally put another point into uh, Fartitude, which I didn't mean to do, but I got really excited. So, I think that that team is just about done. We are now level 32. We're three levels away from getting all the stuff and things that we want. Chitin Keratin, baby. That's what we're talking about. We need to need this stuff. I think I can get into Keratin armor, actually, or Chitin armor right now. So, this guy should be ready to go. He should be tamed up, like, now. Are you done? I don't have any more berries. This is all we've got. It is what it is. I'm just waiting. One more tick. One more little tick. Come on, tick. And we're back, and he's up! The Pteranodon! He is not as beautiful as the other one, which I killed, by the way. Because <laughs> he was dumb. And But this guy's great. 130, or 23rd level. Uh, we lost a lot of our taming effectiveness because of stupid Sabertooth. Uh, but we got 1,000 HPs in this guy. Not bad. 840 stamina. 206.9 melee damage. 135% movement speed. Follow me. I want to see what your flight patterns are like. Oh, I'm liking this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, you fly pretty good. You fly pretty straight. You know, you got to figure... Oh, there's probably terrible, awful things on the way over here. Also, let me see. Yeah, that looked a little bright to me. Uh, You got to figure some of the Pteranodons, like, they probably... Oh, wow, he's fast, man. They probably, uh, like, hurt their wing or whatever. And then they're, like, lopsided a little bit. How am I supposed to get in the house? What the frig, man? Were you... Yeah, you... I don't even know what to name you. Uh, let's go ahead and get a name on this guy. Let's name this guy, uh, Freedom. Freedom! The Pteranodon, because he's going to allow us to soar high to the sky and see stuff and things and probably get killed. I don't know what happened to the Giga, by the way. It just disappeared over into that early area, so hopefully it doesn't come near the base again. But if this is, uh, yeah, we're going to have to, like, rethink how things go. I'm definitely going to go down south and see if it's safe. Uh, cause I'm not really liking this area very much at all. It is super dangerous all the time. Uh, Freedom, if you could land... Okay, here we go. Are you gonna do it? That's the sweet spot, buddy. Stay right there. Whistle passive. You just hang out. Oh, we already got a level. Sweet. So, um, what I've got to do now is I have to grind out some levels. So, let me see here. We're 32. We're running a little bit low. Oh, no, we've got arrows. We don't have any narco berries. Let me see here. Let's go like that. Can we get in... Chitin armor already? Let me see. Chitin. Uh, we can make this and this and this. So if we go inside of Hyan now, ugh. Like so, we squirt in all of our chitin that we got. Check out our armor. Chitin. We need some hot fiber action. Bam, bam, and bam. That should give us some XP. I bet we get a level off of that. At least one. Hopefully. A level? Maybe? Maybe we could just use the old school technique and just build hats until we level up. That's what we used to do back in the day. Back in server one and season one stuff and things times. All right, so we're going to put some more of this hot meat action inside of there. I should have... Oh, we got so much spoiled meat now. We need berries so bad, man. It's crazy. 
Um, I used all the ones that I gathered up on the friggin' tame. So, uh, I gotta grind out some levels. And I'll be our bees, peeps. Hey, we're back! I think I got it. I think my last tick was 35. Yeah, sweet! So we're good to go. We got it. I went and just did some hunting of some stuff. And we're good to go on the level action. Terrain it on saddle. Bam! Alright, let's go back inside of here like so. Wait, oh, uh, This is just inventory craft? It's been such a long time. There we go. Hide, fiber, kite, and carrot. No! Do I have enough? Oh! Oh, no! I need one! You're kidding me. Uh, so we need some hide, some fiber... We need a little bit more hide. I thought I had a plenty. I thought I had tons of hide. There it is, right there. All right, so hide and fiber we're good on. We're short one keratin. One kite. Oh, wait, no, no, no. <laughs> That's right. Superman of thinking. Bam. We did it. Sweet. Also, this should give us some hot experience action as well. You know what I like about this game? I love how it takes the resources, like... At the beginning of the craft. That's really, really good. So, all right. We got some levels. I've been pumping stamina and health a little bit. So, we're good to go on those guys, too. All right. So, this is it. This is the moment of truth. Freedom. Come here, buddy. You know what? I don't think freedom is a really good name. I think that it's not, like, catchy enough. So, I think I'm going to name you F to the D. No, that sounds terrible. Uh, free time? Uh, no. Let me see here. Mouth learning? No, that's that's not good at all. Uh, fart? No. <laughs> and we're back. Peanut! I'm going with Peanut! <laughs> that was the best name we could think of. So I'm going to pump a little bit of stamina. I think we need to get that to 1,000 at least. 125th level guy. How you doing, buddy? All right, let's get on. Oh, we're mounted. Oh, we're flying right now. This is it, guys. We're flying. Freedom. We're flying. We're flying. We're not really moving very far, but we're flying. Oh, now we're moving. Now we're moving. Oh, now we're sprinting. Oh, what was that? Bring a raptor? Yeah. And a saber tooth. All right. So, let's see what this is about, man. Let's go up. Let's go up as high as we can go up. Oh, wait. We got to keep an eye on our stamina. This is not modded. Oh, man. Oh, man. Look at this place. Okay, we got plenty of stamina. It's not that big. I mean, it doesn't feel that big. Um, Look at that little island down there. That looks like a perfect spot. Okay, we are low on stamina. So we're going to fly down here and try not to die to a giga or unbelievable amount of RGs or anything that's terrible and awful. And see if we can see if we can land. I'm just trying to keep my eyes peeled for RGs. I don't want to land in an RG infested area. Is that another T-Rex? There is one T-Rex, two T-Rex. Is that another three T-Rexes? Well, crystal. Okay, we found some crystal. Let's get some stamina back here. Give me that stamina back, baby. We got Dimorphodons galore too. I feel like the spawning and procedurally generated is a little whacked. Um, what are you guys? Three saber tooths and a doe dick, some obsidian and a metal. There's not a lot of metal here. I thought I heard. Oh, I'm dying. Whoa, whoa, whoa! We're ice cubed. Why are we so ice cubed right there? Okay, let's go down a little bit. All right, we're good to go now. Are those allosaurs? How's the stamina? Oh, we're ice cubed again. That's so weird. It's not a cold area. Okay. We're definitely seeing some limitations to the procedurally generated deal. Look at this little area over here. There's a little... Oh, yeah, man. We're dying. Like, it's crazy cold. Okay, we got to head back to base. Where it's warm. <laughs> so there's our first little jaunt, I guess. Um, I'm a little concerned about the unbelievably freezing cold temperatures um, that almost killed us. Even though it's not a snow biome at all. That's weird. Yeah, we're hurt. We're major big time hurt. Where's Peggy? Peggy, just stay right here. How are you doing? You're feeling good? Okay, good. Let's get you up to like maybe 500 HPs. You're so cute. Did you just poop in our house? No, I think... Oh, no, I did. Oh, God, no. All right. So our first, jo our first jaunt out on Peanut went fine, except for the super amazing cold. I really want to head down south to see if it's safer. 
But I feel like it might not be. <laughs> and we're back. I feel like we solved the problem. Uh, <laughs> I went out and got, um, I think, th two more levels, three more levels, pumped it into fortitude. Um, I was able to build the chitin gauntlets and gloves, and now suddenly there's no problem at all. That's so weird. That's super weird. Oh, you know what? It was probably the time of day, too. Derp. All right, so the time of day wasn't good. It wasn't nighttime, but I don't know what time of day it was right then. So, all right, doesn't matter. It's good now. We're definitely good to go. I wanted to do some exploring, like I was saying. Down here, it looks like there's some dillos. So this is more towards the southern area. We got dillos. We got... I'm not seeing any sort of... Huge deposits of anything, though. Oh, there's stone. Our metal. There's a huge amount of metal. Okay, that's good. There's a good amount of metal right there. That's good. All right, where are we? Just so we can remember. Okay, that's where we are. We're trembling. Um, <laughs> let's head... Oh, let's head down. Oh, nothing major? Okay, let's head down here and just rest up and get some stamina real quick. This is a nice little spot right here. What's up, little trike man? How you doing, buddy? So that wasn't too bad of an issue, really. I thought it was like something super weird, but as far as the uh, the coldness goes, but it looks like that we're good. Oh, there's a hot spino. I don't have a spyglass, so I can't really tell what it's all about, and I don't want to get too close to it. The oceans also look really cool. Like, I mean, stuff and things looks fairly normal, like fairly normal, not super normal, but fairly normal. I want to come out to that island. I'm really interested to see what that's all about. Oh man, look at that! There's a huge battle. We're not going to have trouble with getting an RG on this map, that's for sure. They're everywhere, man. There's some Carnos. What's our stamina looking like? We're pretty good to go here. I'm thinking about maybe heading over to one of these islands and building on the island. I just kind of want to see what it's about. And I kind of want to explore down here and see what the best area is. Look at the size of that friggin' salmon. Can you see that? It's humongous. All right, let's see here. Southern area, more peaceful. It definitely appears so. So there is a spino over there. Could you land, buddy? Well, look like right here. There's some pegos. Whoa, 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 whoa! You want to go, son? I don't want to piss anything off that's really scary. Bring it on! Can I... Is it possible to kill this little teeny thing? I think I need to pump my melee damage a little bit. We got to rest. So yeah, like I was saying, this looks good, man. This doesn't look bad. This looks pretty good. This island, it's not flat, so that kind of sucks. Oh, what is that? There's another Spino down there. Holy crap, that one's super cool looking. So there's a nice little flat island right here. I'd love to find a spot on the mainland. Duh. The islands are awesome, though. It's just... This is vanilla, so getting back and forth could be a problem. Um, I guess once we get an RG, it would be really cool. There's definitely a lot of spinal hot spinal action up in this piece, in this area. Let me see about this over here. This area... Whoa, whoa, whoa. That guy landed weird. Maybe this guy's got a brain worm. Spell Whoa, whoa. Okay, my guy's not landing very good. Land. All right, there we go. Maybe over here? This looks like it might not be bad. I think that we're going to have a really hard time finding anywhere that's like super flat like it's just not going to be that way procedurally generated doesn't seem to be flat it seems like it's all bumpy and screwed up but maybe right over here would be good well there's a big battle going on down there well what is fighting that it almost looks like a pego fighting a shark this area right here might not be bad yeah this looks promising this looks promising you know there's a little bit of a water deal right there so we could pipe water up right from this little tiny, teeny tiny puddle right there. Let me see what we got going on up in this area. It looks pretty safe too. Safety third. We might have to move, but that's going to be it for today, ladies and gentle peeps. Tamed a new Pteranodon, super amazing peanut, gave us freedom and possibly also safety from stuff and things. I think in the next episode, we're gonna do some more exploring. We're gonna do a bunch of cool stuff and things, and I think we're gonna to move too. But that's gonna be it for today, peeps. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure if you like the video, please don't forget to show your support and smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. 
And may the stuff and things be with you. Oh, stamina. 